All right, good morning everybody and welcome to another live coffee talk feed here from CRV Medical Center. My name is Lance Rowe and I am the staff recruiter here for the organization. Uh, today I have invited one of our directors from our clinical setting here at the hospital and I will let her introduce herself. Good morning, my name is Kristen Rosa. I am the director of surgical services. Awesome, well thanks again for joining us here today, Kristen. Um, Today we just want to touch base with everybody and obviously share some of the amazing opportunities that we have going on here at CRV Medical Center today. Um, I've also asked Kristen to join us today to talk a little bit more about some opportunities that we have specifically in her area, uh, the OR department, recovery, PACU as well. Um, but to kind of start it off, um, we are still searching for some amazing new talents to join an organization across all areas of the hospital for registered nurses. So if you are an experienced individual uh, looking for a career home change, please do reach out to me directly so we can talk about some awesome opportunities that we have here for you. Um, we are also looking for a director of respiratory. So if you are an individual who has experience in leading a team, um, growing and developing a team as well, and helping really set uh, that department up for the next success in their own careers, um, we've got an awesome opportunity here that has presented itself that I would love to speak with you about. Um, we did just post that position, so please do apply directly through our career page and reach out to me directly. Um, we are also looking for some awesome opportunities still in our CT MRI department, um, as well as our rad tech department. Um, again, a lot of you students out there that are getting ready to graduate fresh out of school in the December cohorts, um, once you have obtained your license directly from the state of California, reach out to me because we definitely would love to help fast track your career path here at CRV Medical Center um, and get your rad tech career started with us. Um, so what I'd like to do today is just kind of go through some questions that's come from the organization, uh, excuse me, the community of Porterville um, in response to opportunities here and specifically for your areas, Kristen. Um, so I would like to kind of kick it off with a question that came from the community directly for you. Um, what type of procedures does the team get involved with here at CRV Medical Center? So at CRV, we typically do what uh, people call bread and butter of surgery. We do a lot of ortho cases, general surgery, um, gynecology, ENT. Uh, we don't any, do any trauma or anything like that. All of that is transferred out. Um, we do a lot of outpatient surgeries and then anything that would come through the emergency room uh, that we would be capable of taking care of. Awesome. And so um, I, I can definitely tell when you speak about the opportunities you have in your department and the different uh, specialties and surgeries that you do see here that you have a pretty strong passion for that. Um, would you mind sharing with us kind of how you got your career started here at CRV Medical Center and how you ended up in the position you're in today? Sure. Um, so I have worked at the hospital since I was 19 years old. Um, I started out as a CNA slash unit clerk in the recovery room uh, while I went to school. I did my prereqs for nursing and then uh, when I was done with nursing school, an opportunity was available in uh, the PACU flux care area. Um, I became a nurse and worked there, uh, worked my way up to being a charge nurse. Um, I then became the manager over that area and adopted endoscopy. And then about a year and a half ago, I became the director of surgery, um, which I now oversee PACU, flux care, endoscopy, central processing, and the operating room. Awesome. And so what is, what's the culture like with the team here? Obviously, CRV Medical Center, we are very uh, culture and vision driven. And, you know, we're all about wanting to provide that support to our patients and really just do everything we can for their health wise. But what is the culture like behind the scenes? Yeah, um, you know, I feel like surgical services is a very team oriented environment. Um, we literally are like a family there. Um, you know, we help each other out, we cover each other when needed. Uh, the managers and myself are willing to step in and work the floor whenever we're needed. Um, you know, the nurses that we work with are amazing. They're compassionate and they're very empathetic. And I think for the most part, you know, they love their job and they love where they're at. Awesome. So, you know, as obviously being your, your recruiting supporter here at the organization, I know that we do bring on a lot of new grads as well in the specialty. Now, aside from new grads, what is it that you're really looking for in individuals who are experienced nurses that are wanting to potentially make that change to the OR department? So, honestly, I would really consider um, any anyone that's experienced that's a nurse that would want to come um, join our team. Um, somebody with a good foundation, uh, obviously someone that's flexible, team player, 
Um, we want people that are, you know, um, inspiring and want to come to work every day and just do their best and help their patients. Um, but we we're open and we have a lot of great opportunities available. Awesome. Well, I appreciate you sharing that with us here today. Um, there was a question that came in from the community for me specifically that I, I want to make sure I touch base on. Um, it's asking to tell us more about the CNA positions you have in your skilled nursing facility. Um, so here at CRV Medical Center, um, as you all know, we do have our distinct part skilled nursing facility um, in-house at the organization. Um, we are looking for amazing new CNAs to join our current team here. Um, if you are an experienced CNA who is already working in a skilled nursing facility um, and you are looking for that change to continue in the SNF world but want to get more involved in the acute care under the hospital setting, um, this is an amazing opportunity for you. Um, in addition to that, while we're talking about CNAs, we do have a director of staff development position open up in our skilled nursing facility as well. So if you are one who has a passion for education, um, for training CNAs, and are very knowledgeable with state regulations, uh, with agencies here involved in California, um, this is an amazing opportunity that I definitely would love to, to speak with you about um, and invite you to apply with us also directly. Um, and I think that was kind of the last question I'd received from the community. Um, definitely encourage you guys all to continue to send your questions in from us directly. I know this is a brief interaction with you all, um, but it's something I love to do with you guys uh, and being part of, of CRV Medical Center here. So I do encourage you to continue to submit your questions here uh, directly with us. That way you can touch base with you also. Um, if you have questions and you want to touch base with me and talk offline more, um, you guys can reach me directly at 559-788-6079. Um, and I would love to, to hear from you directly. And um, Kristen, thanks again for joining us here today. And I uh, hope to see you guys all next time. Thanks again, guys. Bye. Have a great day.